All right, guys, let's check out a limited edition collaboration from Seiko and Rowing Blazers. This is the SRPJ-59 using the caliber 4R36 movement, day date. Retail price, $4.95. They only made 888 of this colorway. I think that's what they made of each colorway. There's a few different colors. There's even a black dial one with multiple colored indexes and in their indices on there. So very cool, fun colorful releases from Seiko and Rowing Blazers. You could pick them up from Rowing Blazers or from Seiko so they each had like their share of uh, quantity from each one. So big thanks to Andrew for sending this in for us to check out. Let's take a look at the dimensions. So the case on this it's basically the the um, Seiko dress KX. It's dubbed that. Uh, it's not really a dress watch. It's more of a sport watch but it's 40 millimeter wide case Lug to lug is about 44.4 millimeter. You do have drilled lugs. You do have a signed crown on this too. It says RB, rowing lasers. The thickness, 13.5 millimeter. You see you have a single domed hard lux crystal there with that distortion. Lug width here, 20 millimeter. This pretty basic bracelet tapers down to 18. And then you kind of have that, again, basic fold over clasp system from Seiko with two micro adjust. So bracelet, nothing to write home about, but overall the design and colorful nature of the watch, plus the limited edition factor of it makes it very fun. Six and a half millimeter push-pull crown. So in this static position here, you can wind the movement. Has a nice wind to it. First position out, you can adjust the day and the date. Last position will hack the movement, stopping the seconds hand for a more accurate time setting. But check out that green colorway. That is... So there's green, blue, orange, and the black. I think those are the colorways. But uh, this green is definitely a good choice. The framed day-date window there is not just square, you know, rectangular framed. It has a little bit of dimension to it. It actually kind of flares out a little bit towards the middle. You can kind of see that design element there. The handset also a departure from, I think, other uh, Dress KXs with a more arrow-tipped minute hand and almost a syringe sword style hour hand with a lollipop balanced and red and white striped seconds hand similar to what is on my rowing blazers here that is in the 5kx series so pretty similar hand um, uh, for the uh, seconds hand so also says rowing blazers on the dial and then it'll also have on the case back on the display case back They'll also have that skeleton sitting there wasting time. And let's see, it does say limited edition. If you look on the perimeter there, it does say limited edition. And then it will have the number down there at the bottom. This is number 98 of 888. So that's a pretty dang legit limited edition quantity. And they do come in this really nice tin. This is just the lid of it. But it has the uh, colors from Rowing Blazers and the squiggly there in their tin that they display. Also comes with, each one of these is going to come with a fabric strap. This one is a purple and black striped one. Each one is going to have a little bit different color, I think. Let's pop this on my 7 and a quarter inch wrist so you can see what it looks like. There it is on my seven and a quarter inch wrist. Nice fun colorway. I'm enjoying it. A lot of people are going to pick these up as collectors because they are a true limited edition. And then I think there's going to be a host of people out there that are actually going to choose to wear them. I prefer to be in that camp. If I were to pick one up, I would actually wear it. If I found the time to do it because I have a million other watches. <clears throat> Let's give it a quick blast with the UV light. Kill the lights in the studio and check the loom. I moved the switches so I have to reach a little bit more. But excellent Seiko loom as to be expected. Plenty bright enough. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys on the next video.